Hi, so in this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to very quickly make a nice chord pad and make the notes continuously slide backwards and forwards so you get that sweeping effect on the chords. And I'm gonna do this using the new MIDI transformation tools. So check this out. So firstly, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to go in and create a new MIDI clip. Then I'm just gonna select a analog instrument. So I'm just gonna bring that into the MIDI clip like that. Select stacks and select chords that have four notes in them. So I'm going to start with this one. I'm gonna add a second stack as you can see it's creating a second set of chords with slightly different but four notes another stack there with slightly different but four notes and the final one because you can only add four with four notes this one here has a couple chords quite high up so i'm going to invert them down a step like that so let's loop this and see how it sounds Let's bring that frequency down a bit. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to select all of these notes and then we're going to select one of the MIDI transformation tools and we're going to select Glissando. We're going to make a curve like that. So let's hear how that sounds. Let's unclick fold and here you can see how the notes are sliding to each other. Let's just change the curve a bit. So let's just change this curve a bit. We'll just move it the other way. Now we can go in and actually manually change the glissando like this, just by moving things around. And if we don't like any of them, we we'll just select all of the notes and then right click clear envelopes. So they're all gone. Now what we can do is we can select two particular notes. Let's say select these two. And then what we can do is create a glissando effect for just those two notes. So it's not so harsh sounding. So let's now connect this note with this note. I'm just pressing shift. So let's use glissando to connect them again, like that. So as you can see, pitch bend movements are really much simpler now than they were in previous versions of Ableton. So what do you guys think of Glissando? I think it's glitteringly amazing.